Hello everybody, my name is Amor Avenger and here we are doing a YouTube review of these and look at these behind you <laughs> Okay people, this is my YouTube video and it's the first video I've ever done today we're gonna get right at it Okay everybody, I'm tired of doing our voice now <laughs> It's just for the warm up right now So we're doing a review of the Samsung Level on Wireless Oh yeah, and uh, today I'm showing you the blue pair. I've had these for a couple months, and these work pretty well. Hey man, they dope. These are uh, also have ANC compatibility and active noice cancellation. Well, that's, that's cool. it. I, I'm at NFC near field communication. Right. And uh, let's see. Get on uh, D's phone over here and uh, <laughs> let me show you these specs. My HTC M9. Let's see. Well, it says they're pretty stylish and you gotta say, they kind of are from a certain point of view. What the hell? There's a hair right there. Get out of there. Alright, they got the level, they got the Samsung's chrome look that they usually have on their phones. It's pretty stylish. It's flexible. It is made out of plastic to let you all know if you don't like that kind of thing. Well, tough. A lot of headphones out there are plastic. But it's got a metal band on the inside. Which is dope. Yeah. You know, it's pretty light of a pretty, weight of one pound. Yeah. Yeah, so. Yeah, pretty durable as well. Yeah. <laughs> Bam. I've dropped these from higher heights, so don't worry. Mm -hmm. I don't even have a scratch on these yet. That's Let's good. see how so. It has a lithium iron battery, which most everything does right now. Noise mm -hmm. isolation for when it does ha doesn't have the active noise cancellation on, which you can turn on and off by this switch. All right. Doesn't matter, it's, that's, it's indestructible. That's, that's basically it for uh, the specs. But the look and feel feels great yeah, in the hand. It's uh, feels natural with the hand being contoured. Since mm -hmm. it'll be on your head, it'll be on your head, and you'll be just chilling. I could barely hear anything yeah. right now. It feels in your head so pretty I'm, good. I'm trying to keep my voice loud, voice down. Oh, now you are. But, <laughs> shut up. Mm -hmm. but it's pretty, pretty nice feeling in the hand since you have to be like this to turn the, the switches, turn it off and on. But oh, not just a feature that we haven't got to yet. Notice how there's not no up, up or down, volume up or down, or anything buttons on this. Well, let me show you something. See right here, you got a touchpad. That is dope. Yeah, you turn your volume up and down by swiping up. You change your tracks by swiping left and right, and you double tap the pause, click, activate call or anything. And you see these holes right here? Let me get them. these are your mics. You got another one right here, and these are noise cancellation mics, so that environment noise around you doesn't interfere with your call. Alright, that's pretty dope, huh? Okay. Well, oh yeah. You think this was only a one headphone review, was it? <laughs> you were crazy wrong. Crazy, do the mumble like a crazy, mumble like a crazy, mumble, mumble like a crazy, mumble, mumble like a crazy. Oh, yeah. These are the beats solo to one. I've never seen those. <laughs> I've never See, seen hey, those. she's a fan, man. She's a fan. Let, let her be a fan of, of the Morbid it Avenger. It appears the Morbid has a fan. <laughs> <laughs> These are the Beats Solo 2 Wireless. I've had these for about a month now. And, uh, well, they're pretty stylish as well. They have the usual Beats contour. They're looking like the, they're looking like the new studios these days. I've never had a pair of studios, but I've seen pictures of them and they look pretty nice. They're, these have a slim band and these are also plastic as well. So that's what makes them but, lightweight, though. I mean, you know, yeah, to a certain these, extent, <laughs> these maybe weigh a pound and a half at least. 
or at most, probably at most, but they're uh, still flexible, but these are the tempered plastic, so these have a more durability than these, which is just straight plastic, mm -hmm. but yeah. shake test, pretty good. See, pretty notchy. Beats aren't really known for their hinges, but hey, that's not what we're here for. But these <laughs> are pretty durable. These do fold up pretty nice with a clearing click. Yeah, pretty good one. Metal band as well, all the way in inside the headband, which is also nice for uh, keeping it on your head, basically. And both cushions on these. Our faux leather, but this one's a more of a silk base. This one's more of a cotton base. <laughs> which, it depends on what you're interested in, which the feel might be for you. But, <sighs> if, uh, if you're a Beats fan, you should uh, be proud to know that Beats are no longer from Monster. Apple bought them from Monster, and these are their first wireless on-year headphone. And I, uh, I say first wireless because they haven't put out a studio or any wireless earbuds out yet. They have put out the Solo 2s, which were the wired versions, and the Beats Pill Plus within the year they, ha they have bought from Monster. Anyway, I'm jumping over my words. <laughs> These are pretty nice looking. I went with the shock yellow. And the price range from these will cost you, uh, turn these around for you. The Samsung level on wirelesses, I paid $169 two months ago. And I looked on Amazon just recently and the price is down to $124. So if you're interested in these and you're good and you're a Samsung fanatic, these are pretty good. You should check them out for other YouTuber reviews and all that, unboxings, all that. Me, I'm not doing an unboxing because me, I say it's just a box, nothing to fantasize about. <laughs> the Solo 2 wirelesses, I got these a month ago and I paid 219 I haven't checked the price yet, but I'm pretty sure it has lowered, being a severely branded item. Alright, well, that's my portion of the video for now. We're going to take it to D's, and he's going to do a sound test on his phone. Oh yeah. Alright, so at the moment he's going to... Go through his sound settings, make sure he doesn't have any uh, bass booster action. Yeah, because we want just Bluetooth. pure quality sound and yeah. pure driver sound of these. Oh, no phone up. boost added for <laughs> legit qualities. Legit qualities. <laughs> yep. You know All it. Right. Scan for devices. A lot of um, Bluetooth people I've connected to. <laughs> <laughs> Well, first off, we're going to start with the uh, Oh, yeah, you should go ahead Samsung's. and turn it on, actually. <laughs> well, oh, okay. Okay, never mind. Uh, I got it. Might Evo. connect to my phone. Oh. Just turn your Bluetooth off. Uh, or. Yes. Because I see Evo, but I, obviously All it's right. not true. I'll just put these in uh, search mode, and there they are. All right, dope. All right, see that? All right, Samsung level on. All right, all right. Go ahead and tap that. All right, device connected. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Try <laughs> Let's do it. All right. So it's it's connected right now. So uh, right. what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to a random song, I guess. Or a all right. We had some technical difficulties, but we're back now. Hello. We're heading to D's, and he's going to get started with the sound test and his opinions and see if this product is worth it for the money. I accidentally turned off the camera. 
But all right, anyway, so uh, yeah, dude. Uh, okay, I guess first comes first, man. Like the uh, the connectivity is very good. You know what I'm saying? It, it connects super fast. You know, you gotta worry about waiting and sitting there. You know what I'm saying? Um, let's see. Let's go to a song real quick. Let's go to some random beat or something. Uh, what I got? What I got? What I got? Yeah, it's, it's pretty dope too. I did not know about the actual uh, touch thing either. That is really nice. Yeah, touch pads only on the right side, just to let you know. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Very, 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 very nice. <laughs> yeah. All right, I guess we're just gonna go to a random. Are we gonna do? Uh, of course, we're gonna do like outside, right? Like outside. Okay. Like yeah, we could. <laughs> we have a noisy environment out there. Mm -hmm. No, I meant like, like, um, not like on my head, like just like listening to it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what you meant. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> you said, yeah, we can go outside. <laughs> no, no. Ah, shut up. All right, man. Yeah, okay, so it's playing right now, actually. Have you, do you have this one turned up? Uh huh. That is so dope. Well, I just did. It ain't really bad, man. It's a nice. So, picture that in your ear, man. I mean, for those experts, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you can see, you know, that you can hear this here itself, but it, you know, it's just so we don't get uh, copyrighted. Yeah. Just give a shout out to these song producers out here. Yeah, man, the song, man. The song is dope. These songwriters gotta get all the credit they need. All right. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, man, let, let me show you, uh, real quick. You hear it right? Slide down. See? Dope. It really works. <laughs> all right. It's dope. Oh, I thought I could stand. That'd be dope. But anyway, yeah, man. So far, connectivity is really good. Like I said, um, connects to the phone like that. Like well, I, 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 I did you going to uh, you yeah. going to put them on your head and listen? Well, yeah, actually well, feel not. it. <laughs> Describe it in your best words. Yep. Well. Feels pretty good. Yes. <laughs> All right. I can't hear anything. Hit the <laughs> hit the switch on the I'm bottom sorry. switch, the A and C. Get that turned on. Oh, okay. I get it. That's dope. Yeah, these, these sound very good. You know, like, they're very loud. They're actually. I feel like they're a spot worth the money when it comes down to value wise. Um, I haven't actually tried the uh, the beats yet, so we're gonna actually uh, jump to those real quick. You know. So uh, yeah, man. Yeah, I'm supposed to wear glasses. Don't feel like it right now. <laughs> All, right. All right. I'm supposed to wear glasses too, but I got contacts on. Let's see. Uh, turn these bad boys off. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Let's see the connectivity test. I'm go ahead and turn and, uh, these. They automatically disconnected, obviously. All and right. To Get these turned on. All right, man. I want to search for device. All right, now. Real quick, let's see. Very fast. That was really good. No waiting, no stalling, no, you know, no BS around. See, that light was flashing, now it's not. Uh -huh. All right. All right. Outside test first. See ya. Turn those up. Down the side, you have to, um, yeah. all right, that sounds pretty good, man. Um, yeah. now the side of these. And of course, it's not a touchpad. You know, they don't really do that. They but have the um, 
There's hidden buttons. Yeah, they have the uh, little op, you know, used to, you know, iPod they used to have back in the day. Yeah, just go ahead and turn up with that. Turn it down with this. That's how you know Apple is taking over. When you when you see the beats, but you just got that iPod, you know, what I'm saying feature in there with it, you know. Uh, but it's pretty, it's pretty right. dope. You know what I'm saying? Get a on head look and feel. Oh yeah, yeah. So which way? Right, right, left. That's what it's going to Yeah. Yes, you sound also very good. For um, and these and they're pretty uh comparable too. Like these are over the ear headphones, right? And these well, are actually not. Basically, Sam, these are Samsung's on-ear version of headphones. Yeah, and they're really big actually. And the uh, I actually do know the driver size of these. If people are worried and questionable, these are forty millimeter. And right. to me, they are on over-ear headphones for my ears. I have small ears. Mm -hmm. So these are pretty good for me, but the over ear versions, the level over wireless, going to be a higher price, but they're 50 millimeter. But I advise going with these for bass heads if you do choose these, because the 40 millimeter ones do have a bit more control of bass, and it does have a bit more punch. Dope, dope. Yeah, man. These um, just as well. They're also. Um yeah. On ear, you know what I'm saying? They're they're about 30 millimeter, right? Something like that, around there. Uh, the driver size is still uh, unreleased. Oh, okay. But yeah, it's about 30, 35 ish, I yeah. guess. Yeah. So if you do the measurements smaller. yourself. <laughs> right. They're not. <coughs> <coughs> I'm sorry. Um, they're not as deep, um, actually, as these, but as the um the level ones, but they are they are just as bassy, if not. If not a little more, you know, honestly, like they're pretty, they're pretty good though, you know. Very, very comparable, you know. Like they have one has the clicker for the volume right here. One, one has the uh, touch up and down. Um, pretty easy to get two buttons on it, you know, on this one. You know, buttons are pretty, pretty not on there actually. Not, not as many, not as you know, cluttered. Um, also, also another feature that. I forgot to mention, my bad, is my that bad. <laughs> when it's powered on, your power button glides up, and uh, also, click this, you have an LED indicator of your battery level, and so that's good. That's your connection button, connection light, so it'll flash when you're in your searching or uh, connecting all that and it'll stay lit if you're connected right, right, right. yeah that's good that's real good and, uh, yeah the uh, maneuverability of these as well are pretty good you know they um they suit your comfort pretty, pretty well actually you know they and the um the, the cushions are are dope actually you know these are these are good as well of course you know this is a dif different texture though but they're both pretty good uh these these are a little softer but yeah these, more you know, like what i said uh good as well for like ears. what i said more of a more of like a silk texture on these yeah. and more of a cotton based texture on these yeah i'm more stitched you know and yeah. uh you got Vented holes on here for breathable cushions, mm -hmm. like you can see on the uh, SMS uh, Street wireless ones that they're that SMS Audio is making, the newer models. And like Beats, you just have this, and it's the, the rubber texture. Yeah. yeah. The only the only downside I really wish is that they could at least put more cushion on, like they did on this. Yeah. Yeah. But overall. The distribution of weight between the clamp force of these being on your ears. This seems sufficient up padding, though, if tested in real life. But that's uh, that's about the wrap up of this video. All right, if you if you like the video and you like the battle, uh, be sure to like, like, uh, comment, or subscribe if you wish. And, uh, yeah.
two major companies, Samsung versus Apple here, and uh, honestly, my opinion on these after listening to for them uh, for a while, I'd have to go with these. Apple did a really good job with Beats, and I say, uh, Apple, you're going in the right direction with these. You're, uh, you're redemption Beats. And Samsung, you also did a really good job with your very first premium line of headphones. Uh -huh. yeah. Besides the earbuds that come with phones that you make uh, for actual professional headphones that you're starting to do. These are pretty top notch. Uh -huh. You know, you had the idea of making good headphones with active noise cancellation, which is very good for people who just travel, you know, being on airplanes. Uh -huh. You, uh, for a very good and decent price. So, yeah, so that, that's about this about wraps it up and, uh. That was like so. Uh, so Sorry about that, guys. As we were wrapping up the video, I got interrupted by a call from my mom. It happens, guys. But, as I said before, my name is Moid Avenger, and I'll be uh, seeing you guys in the next video.